there anyone else in the audience who would like to speak in favor of this request? Okay, hearing none, is there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in opposition to this request? Please come forward, state your name and address, please. Good evening. Uh, my name is Tim Riddle. I live at 2002 Oakdale Drive in Valdosta. More pertinent to the case at hand, I'm the new general manager of the Tourism Authority and Rainwater Conference Center. It's uh, probably located immediately across the street from the subject property. And opposition is kind of a strong word. I guess we would say concern uh, more than opposition. We're not opposed to development at all. Even though the property around that area is zoned off the CH, uh, most of the recent developments in the area have been in the CC variety. You mentioned Gander Mountain Academy Sports. There's a Cheddar's restaurant that doesn't look too old to me. I've been here about six months. And uh, our concern is that uh, we just would like to see developments that complements the things that are already there and enhances our operation as a tourism destination, a conference and meeting destination. Uh, we have plans for the future, hopefully to grow our business. and. Uh, we just don't want to see anything that would possibly detract from that. And, you know, communities need car dealerships and many warehouse storage places and things like that, and we all use them. Uh, but immediately adjacent to us, we just would hope that uh, uh, some thought would go into that and, and obviously has about what would best complement uh, some of the things that are already there. And, and again, I feel people, we're, we're not opposed to development at all. I don't know if anybody in the meetings and destination and tourism and conference business likes any business that closes at 5 o'clock, but it just doesn't do much for the people that are they're attending things when they're looking for that entertainment and retail and those type of uses, you know, after hours that, that helps promote us as a conference destination. And that's uh, that's just kind of where we're coming from. Okay. Do we have any questions for Mr. Uh, of course, Mr. Page? All right, it, it looks like we're dealing with two issues here. The immediate would be a El Torreo, which we have a growing up here with possibly a Honda, I'm sorry, Honda dealership. Excuse me for that. Had not had supper yet. I'm the same way. When I saw El Torreo on the name, I thought that was a restaurant. Excuse me for that. I'm looking at the rendering right here. You tell me. Is it because it's a dealership or do you feel like? You know, it's, it's just that type of use. It just doesn't compliment. Uh, you know, what we're trying to do on the property across the street is bring people to town give them things to do once they're out of their meetings and conferences. So hotels, restaurants, retail, those are the kinds of things which enhance us as a destination. And the more that we have closer, I, you know, I love seeing Gander Mountain open. I love seeing Academy Sports open. Uh, and uh, those are the kind of things that when we sell Valdosta as a destination for meetings, we give them, here's the list of things you can do when you're not stuck in a meeting room. And things, the more things you have in close proximity to your meeting destination, just makes you a stronger destination, stronger sale. We're trying to get that kind of business. And you've seen the proposed. I have not seen the ranger. Okay, do we have any other questions, Mr. Okay, thanks, sir. Thank you.